Let's come back to G. E, F, G. Here we've got our three chords for blues in G. So let's, uh, let's do a little bit of a, a modulation on this chord. What I like to do is just add the sixth here. I strum the, the root and the fifth twice, those top two strings twice, and then I just add my pinky to the seventh fret of the fifth string. Uh, conversely, if you want to, blues being the simple thing that it is, if you just want to keep a good rhythm on those two notes, it's perfectly acceptable and will get you through the progression. But for right now, I'm just going to be adding the six because I like that modulation. So let's do that for four beats. So you do the one for four beats, then you come down to the four and you do that for four beats. Then back to the one for eight beats. Go down to the four chord for eight beats. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Back up to the one chord for eight beats. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now let's go to the five chord for four beats. Three, four. Down to the four chord for four beats. And then you're going to come back to the one chord for four beats. Then finish on the five chord for four beats. Hi, I'm Scotty Moore. Crying all the time. She came back, handed me the slip of paper, and I looked at it and I said, That was Presley. What kind of damn name is that? Starting with the first fret across strings one and two at the, the first fret, second finger on the second fret of the third string, so that's a little part of an F chord there. Well, that was just a lie. Oh, you ain't never caught a rabbit.